Dina thinks she's a, a badass now because... <laughs> what am I tell I'm going to call it out. Because every item we've sold on the new store has yeah. been something Dina selected. And then, yeah, the yeah. store. I, okay. have to, I don't want to toot my own horn, no, but do. it's you true. You do, and I just did because you told me to. So, okay, moving on. <laughs> oh, that's it? No, the go with the guys. No, great job, Dina. <laughs> <laughs> I thought there was going to be like a joke or something. No, anyway. Okay. Hey guys, Dina here with Journey for Profits. Welcome back. And today I'm going to show you guys what sold over the long weekend. So let's just jump right into it. Okay, the first one is the Izod Women's Leggings. This was one of our older items. Yeah, bins. So, yeah, it was our bins. But they were they look like new, very nice pant leggings, thick material. And that's the only reason why I grabbed them. So we made about nine bucks on this uh -huh. item. I mean, not so bad for a bin item, right? So. Right about it, we're trying to blow out of this stuff. Yeah, too, right? we are, we're trying to just get rid of them. So anyhow, uh, our next one is the Cutter and Buck Golf Women's Jacket, super cool. Golf. Again, golf, another, yeah, another golf item that's sold. Yeah. So if you see my last video, I sold a pair of golf pants and something else People too. People are having cabin fever, I guess they're yeah. right. But not everyone is in the winter no, though. No, no. But, but even, even in the Southeast, it's cool. Right, Okay. so anyhow, cool. Cutter and Buck Jacket, you can see it here, I put it up when you're over. And let's see here, it's, um, we sold it for $29.99 and it was a bin item, so 90 cents we paid for it. Cool. And it was free shipping, so we made an $18 profit on that jacket. And nice. it was it was in great, great condition. So. And we got rid of one more thing. Yeah, so golf, golf clothing. That's what's going right now for us. It's yeah, and selling. I'm sure for everyone, it's just mm -hmm. the season, everybody's having cabin fever. Pretty soon it'll be bikinis. <laughs> Next is the Brooks Brothers Polo Shirt. Yeah. I love this color, right? This color theme, it's the green with yeah. the light blue. I think that was an 1800 something brand. Yeah, Is that different really... brands for Brooke Brothers? Yeah, but the color was yeah. like so nice. And paid five bucks, a little higher than usual. But again, the color and the weight, the Well, that the wasn't style. a big item. That's why. Because that's right. the typical thrift store is Polo five bucks shirts. what you're going to pay anyway. And it was a nice one. And it was, it was a really nice one. Nice. So, so I think, yeah, you I think can we, see it here. The price is about right. We just spoiled. We buy bin stuff. So. Yeah. We sold it for twenty nine ninety nine plus shipping. Nice. Yeah. That's and cool. so we made a profit of 21 buccarinos on that shirt. Wow. I thought they were yeah. coming down with that. No so, one offered on that, huh? No. They just bought it straight up. Uh, and that, this is all on our eBay store. We there, do put offers out. Yeah, we do. Okay. We do. Okay, so the next item is the Land's End Women T-shirt. Not T-shirt, okay. like sweater shirt, short okay. sleeve. But it's Supima cotton. That's the difference. Difference, yeah. Right. The Supima cotton, you guys, usually sells for a little bit more. Yeah, it's better quality, um, softer. Right. It's it just the feel alone is different. Some people are just like, I don't know, sensitive Yeah, to they cotton. like Supima yeah. cotton. Anyhow, we pay 90 cents for it. Again, it was a bin item. And we sold it for $19.99 plus shipping. So we made about $16. That's good. Sixteen See, that's bucks when you on make this. money, when you pay nothing. Right. And you saw that you're okay. So that so, was plus shipping? Right. Wow. Plus shipping. Mm -hmm. good. So good that's job. a good one. I keep looking down because I have my notes here, guys. <laughs> so a lot of these shirts, you're what you're doing is because unfortunately we listed a lot of our items free shipping. Yes. Right? We bought into and I'm not saying you shouldn't do it that no, way. No, and that's okay. We like if you're starting out the free shipping, yeah. free returns. Right. Blah blah blah. We're changing that, right? We're going to Plus we'll, shipping. We'll, We'll take a return, but you're going to pay for it. Right, buyer. We'll, we'll take us. We'll, we're not. You're going to pay for shipping. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Um, just because that limits the returns, it really does. Right. Right. People right. think twice about just oh, let me send this back. Sure. Right. At our dime. Right. So I get it. We're we're trading some cost. Mm -hmm. But my point is, you you're doing a good job at when you're when you're submitting offers to these yes. folks, you're adding shipping. I am. So you're tweaking, you're editing, and you're adding. Yeah. This is how we're getting some Instead of, these. of changing all thousand items that I have on which there, we which can't you do cannot because do. Because in our description, we have free right. shipping. Right, because you have to change. We have to change everything forever. on there. So what yeah. I do is when eBay says send offers there, they send it to you daily. That's when I go and revise those offers and I add the and plus you edit shipping the description. and I edit to buyer pays time, return at right. that time and also depends on the item I'm not going to offer them uh, such a high price when they still have to pay shipping and all that stuff but I do always put buyers return shipping that's for sure but that's, it's relative because yeah. you're also willing to give them a better deal 
Correct. Because they're paying for the shipping. Yeah. So it's all relative. We're right. not. Right, no. no one's getting over on anyway. It's no. just it slows down the returns. It does it does, and it, it has so and the sales. But we're willing to take that risk. Yeah. So anyhow, um, Adidas. Next item, Adidas. Uh, Adidas women's shorts. Another bin item, right? Another bin item. Yeah. Remember those? Yeah. Uh, we sold like this one, for example. That stuff weighs nothing. Yeah. Right. Nineteen ninety nine. We sold it for free shipping. Cool. So we made like a ten dollar profit. Even so, with free shipping. Even with shipping free shipping. Probably was like what? Three sixty four bucks. Yeah. Cool. So not so bad. I'll put it up there. The next one, I'll put it right here too. Nike Pro Combat Men's Sleeveless Shirt. Yeah. Now guys, look for the Nike Combat Pro. Those sell. Yeah. I mean for us we do well with those. Anything Nike sells, but when you add Pro com Combat or that, something along those lines, salute right. to service, they do well. So this was a dollar fifty and we sold it for nineteen ninety nine with free shipping again and our profit was about ten dollars. Ten dollar profit on that shirt. When I mean, we paid it nice. that, right? So that's a good deal. Again, Nike Pro Combat. Keep an eye on those. Because yeah, they're we, good we've selling. Got a ton of the Pro Combat, right? Yeah. Next is the um, Nike women's like a pullover shirt, athletic shirt, long sleeve. I went with this one because of the graphic, the gray stripes. I almost kept it for myself. Mm. honestly but I did sell it five dollars I paid for it we did pay up for it um, just because of the graphic I just love the print well it wasn't a bin item so you probably right. bought it at the thrift which is five bucks anyway yeah so um, we sold it for twenty nine ninety nine with free shipping okay and we made fifteen dollar profit on it nice so not so shabby right we'll take that. Uh, wow. our next item is the botanic canisters Do you guys remember mm. my last mm -hmm. video I'll put it up here so you can see. When we found these items, canisters, along with the other items, well, they sold. <laughs> so Dina thinks she's a, a badass now because, <laughs> we're going to tell them, we'll call it up. Because every item we've sold on the new store has yeah. been something Dina selected. On the, yeah, the yeah. new store. I, okay. have to, I don't want to toot my own horn, no, but do. it's you true. You do, and I just did because you told me to. So, okay, moving on. <laughs> oh, that's it? No, they go with the canisters. No, great job, Dina. <laughs> I thought there was going to be like a joke or something. No, anyway, that's it. That's it. so the botanic canisters, and no, they're not for seeds. I know I said that before. <laughs> I don't know what I was thinking, maybe because of the flower print on the front, but they're not. I they're think for I like. I led you to believe they were for seeds. Yeah, he's, I'm so gullible sometimes. Anyway, I thought they were for seeds. We paid seven dollars for the whole thing, for all three, and we sold it for fifty nine ninety nine plus shipping. Yeah. So we made a whopping forty four dollars made me nervous because the guy was the fed we saw the fedex <gasps> guy yeah today when we went to drop off the canisters, the canisters. at fedex the, while rich is inside taking the canisters. box in i'm watching the guy outside packing his fedex the truck FedEx and driver. he's literally going like this he's just launching launching it into the box into the truck and i'm just praying and i got he yeah, doesn't do that so. with our with our bin. so good thing for insurance with our box and these things were flying all the way to cali from yeah. pennsylvania to California. To California. <laughs> so fingers crossed. Time paid thirty dollars. <laughs> we shipping. put like twenty fragile stickers and they, on it. So. I think they purposely throw it when you put fragile stickers. Really? I I would. I would. Like, Anyhow. Oh, yeah. Fragile, yeah, I hear that. Fragile. Anyhow, we made forty four bucks on this yeah, on the canister, a, so again, that was that a good was deal. One of Dina's picks. <laughs> so t look guys, keep an eye out on just things that like look I don't know what you like sometimes that works because I thought those were really pretty what drew me into them were the the wooden tops yeah they look qual it's the quality, quality. Thing. yeah the wooden tops I yep. said mm, let me take a look at this and that's what happened and that seals to yeah. the little rubber gaskets yeah because I have no idea about canisters or ceramics anything I'm learning I'm learning right. as I go with that but you know what quality is so so that's all with the our eBay store and now for posh I only did two posh is slowly that. creeping up um, it's very needy uh, but we sold two. I'm grateful. So anyhow, Levi women's 512 jeans. We had these forever. It's another bin item. Yeah, we haven't <laughs> bought a pair of Levi jeans no. since we first started. Right. No Levi jeans. Me? No more jeans. <laughs> no more Le Ralph Lauren button down. Right. I'm done. But anyhow, Levi 512 jeans. These are the super stretchy comfy kinds that us women love so much. So we paid 76 cents for these Levi 512 super comfy jeans. So for 20 bucks, and we made fifteen dollars. So this is on posh. So shipping is That's not right. included on here. Posh. So excited! I'm cool. glad they're they're going to a good home. And that's I'm that. getting the hell out of here. 
Yeah, really stuff. Next is this Irish t-shirt. Super cool whiskey Irish t-shirt. I found these at the bins. Cool. And I thought they were such a great print. How and ironic. Always, March is coming. Yeah, for St. Patty's Day. Yeah. And you know, that's what I thought about it when I found them at the Probably bins. Probably why. I thought they were super cool. Well, someone's getting ready to get hammered. Right. So, <laughs> party on St. Patty's Day. I don't think Day. you show up to church with an I am Irish shirt. I think you show up <laughs> to the bar. Yeah, to the bar. the car. Pack my car. <laughs> so, anyhow, we sold it for eight bucks, so I made seven dollars on it. It's a t-shirt, bin item. I'm just happy it went. Yeah. And that's, that's that. That's good. So, two things on Posh. I'm hoping it starts picking up again. I'm having my assistant, um, she's helping me more with the sharing so I told her let's focus on that because we we're focusing a lot on the following and I've we kind of flipped it a little bit so now between me and her we're sharing hardcore and I can do some of the following and she could just focus on sharing so and this is a what's all video so you can probably do a posh I can assistant how you got her how you found her yeah I can do that Maybe. if you guys want to see you, that right. let me know comment below I don't want to just make a video if you guys aren't interested in it um, and just Give me some advice, like comments and let me know what you want to see. Right. I'm here to help you guys and show you guys what works for me and maybe it works out for you guys. You can, right? Yeah. Learn. Okay, no. so that's about it with this video with the what solds. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, give me a thumbs up. <laughs> and if not, thumbs down. Don't forget to subscribe. Yeah, don't forget to subscribe because again, honestly, when you guys subscribe, it just motivates me to do more and more of these videos and I get all motivated and excited to do it for you guys. So anyway, um, that's about it. Here comes Remy. And on that note, oh. <laughs> she's hungry, so I have to go feed her. And that's not, I'm not talking about Rich, I'm talking about the dog. <laughs> Rich is starved to death. Okay. So thanks for watching, you guys, and keep pushing, and I'll see you on the next one. Bye.